Smart. You think it's a coincidence we get this? It's not so easy when you've got to use your brains instead of your fists. Maybe I can use my batarang to transfer an electrical charge to that fuse box. I need to figure out a way to transfer that electricity to the fuse box inside the room. That'll open the door. box inside. If I could somehow overload it with electricity... Maybe I can use my batarang to transfer an electrical charge to that fuse box. Uh, typical. I mean, why apply cognitive resources to a problem when you can just throw crap at it?
if you had asked nicely, I'd have opened it for you. Congratulations are in order. Maybe you're not as stupid as I've been led to believe. Why are you doing this, Enigma? Direct. I like it. So, I'll tell you. Gotham sullied. It's filled with brutes who control this city through violence and intimidation. You didn't answer my question. Because you didn't let me finish! <clears throat> I want to get rid of them, Batman, to improve Gotham's intellectual and moral standing. But I'm not a thug like you. My approach is a bit more... refined. What you're doing is no different than stealing. There's nothing refined about it. <laughs> Your response is as predictable as it is banal. Goodbye. Now I can access the SIM card I took from that arms dealer and hack Penguin's communications. associated with any known wireless frequency. Ah, yes, I see it here. Looks like Penguin runs his own private wireless network using laptop transmitters serving as ad hoc comm stations. He's feeding his men frequencies via two-way radio. There are two of these comm stations near your position. Good. Mark them on my map. If I can find and hack those walkie-talkies, I can triangulate Penguin's position. Won't be able to find Penguin unless I get the SIM card from their walkie-talkie.
Just not built for this sort of thing. 